Good morning, good afternoon, wherever you're from. JRO here, host. Big Hair Hits every Monday, 8 to 10 p.m. AlleghenyMountainRadio.org. Board game review, Carcassonne. Here we go. Now, it doesn't really have a board. It has a bunch of tiles that you lay down as you play, which makes the game different every time, which is why I like it. Now, what I'm going to show you are solo rules that I made up. And here are some of the main tiles. Here we go. In order to score points, got your little people guys right here, little meeples, right? And tiles that you'll run into playing this game. Uh, you got city tiles, you got intersections and roads, rivers, and monasteries. And the way you score points, and we'll go through a round really quick. Uh, as you pick tiles out of the bag, I just put them in a big old bag too. You pull them out and you try to match them up. And uh, see that will match up right there. You can put it right there if you like. And uh, this monastery, if you pull that out of the bag, fine. Boom. And this road right here, fine. And uh, this river can go right here. Now the rules I made up is that you cannot go any higher than seven rows that way and seven rows that way. So it kind of uh, confines you there. And uh, what you do is to score points, uh, I want to keep building off that city. So I'll put one of my little people there. And as I pull tiles out, I'll keep building up that city. Once it becomes all enclosed to these walls, then I score points. Same thing with this road. Uh, once this road becomes closed by getting another one of these little little villages at the end then I'll score points there so I want to put my little guy there as I pull tiles out I want to build up the road hopefully find a little village to close it off get my points but not go past seven rows in either direction and then with the monastery what you gotta do is you gotta fill you gotta surround it by tiles it has to be every tile needs to be touching it and then you score your points there. All right, let's do a quick round. And here we go. Let's put those back in the bag. La -dee -da -dee -da. <laughs> and it comes with a scoreboard. And you use one of your little guys to keep score. No big deal. Now this one you always use as a starting tile. You got a little bit of city right there and a road. And I want to, before I even pick out a tile, I want to claim that right there boom so hopefully i want to build that up and score some points i also play that you can't put more than one of your little meeple dudes on a tile so you can't do a road in the city and uh, you can only place your meeple you can only do one per round so watch this here we go let's grab something out of the bag here la -dee -da -dee -da. <laughs> Aha, uh -huh. okay, so we have many choices here. We can go like that if we want. Um, now, I could score some points and just make a little tiny city there like that, but I won't, I'm going to take my chances and uh, keep on going with that. Uh, so let's see. Da, da, da. Ah, we'll put them like that, see? And then I can build, I can have these city pieces touch each other. So let's see what happens. Really quick game. I think it's kind of fun. Here we go. Aha! Another city piece. Now, we have the road here. You know, many choices on where to put it there. Uh, you know, you can put it over here. But seeing that I'm trying to build up the city, I'm thinking, uh, why don't we put it just like, hmm, let's see, let's see. Nah. Uh, we'll put it like that. There we go. And let's grab another one. Aha, a monastery. Now, like I said before, at, this thing's got to have tiles all around it. So, and again, I can't go more than seven in this direction, seven rows in that direction. So, keeping that in mind, you know, I can put them upside down. And, uh, yeah. Well, what do you think? Maybe like that? And then maybe I'll get a road to connect that. Yeah, why don't we do that? There we go. Now, in order to go for that to score for points, I can put one of my dudes on it. Now, the decision-making here is I have a limited amount of dudes. So, 
you get your dude back once you score the points on what you're trying to build. So let's see, let's keep building, keep building, la di da di da. Ah, another city thing. Can we put that? See, we can't put it there because grass can't touch that. See, now that can touch that there, but see, the city can't touch grass. So we have to put that somewhere else. Once you have three tiles that you can't put somewhere or you choose not to put somewhere, once you throw three of them out, then the game's over. If you fill up the entire 7x7 seven seven grid here without any mistakes, without having to throw a tile out, then you get an extra five points. And uh, let's see, where can we put this guy? How about, right? Well, I'm going for this monastery, right? So he's got to be uh, surrounded. And plus, I might be able to make a little city down there. So maybe I'll put the guy down there. La di di, la di da. All right. All right, let's uh, close this guy out just for laughs. Make the video short. Okay, I got a little city here. Each tile that's involved in building it is two points each, so you got two four points. So you score four points on your little guy right there. There we go. And you get this guy back to claim something else. Da -da 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 -da. Aha. What can we do with this? Uh aha. Again, we're oh see I can't do that because the grass is touching the road. Can't do that. Um looks like I'm going to surround this monastery, so uh, how about we just kind of do that. There we go. Da, 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 da. I'm going to put a little dude on there in case this road gets closed off. Then uh, I can claim that road for some points. Da, da, da. Aha! Can't do... Nope, can't do that. Can't do that. Best I can do is do that, and I didn't put a dude on there to claim it, so I do not score any points there. Oh yeah, oh another monastery. So why don't we put it uh, right here? Grass touches grass. Put a little guy on it so that if it gets surrounded, then we'll score some points. Do -do 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 -do. Oh man, what am I gonna do with that? Uh, nope. Nope. I guess I can do this. Okay, and I'll just put a dude on there. Just in case I make a little city. That's fine. Just in case. Okay. Bop -ba -bop -bop. Ooh. Can we do that? There we go. Can we do that? Yes, we can. Alright, good example here. See, it's surrounded by walls, so we're good. And each tile that's involved in building a city is two points each. And if you got that little coat of arms, a little shield guy, that's actually two points. So we got two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten points over here. Boop, boop, boom. It gives us up to 14. And then we get our little dude back. Right, let's pull out a couple more tiles. And we got to close this out. Here we go. Oh, I'm going to put this guy. Eh, we'll just put him uh, put him right here. Boom. And we'll put a little dude on there. Maybe clean him. Let's see what we got. Da -da -da. Okay, road. Uh, that one. That's easy. We can just put that right there for now. That'll work. Okay. Da -da -da. Another road. That's easy. I'm going to stick that right there. I'm just going... Um, then you place down just so you can see now when you're playing these by the real rules and multiplying all that it's n you don't have to confine yourself to seven up and seven the other way you can just use all the tiles just build this huge thing on the table which is kind of cool uh grass touching grass it's fine there uh, water you got some water tiles in there here and there but Okay, there's the monastery down there, so I want to try to surround it. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, check that out. Closes that out. Oh. So, let's see. If I were to continue this game, uh, to score for this monastery, I need to fill those two up. And uh, as you can see, I'm getting close to my seven row limit each way. But, you know, it's pretty cool. Carcassonne. 
you know, easy to set up, easy to play, and that's it. Big Hair Hits, every Monday, 8 to 10 p.m., AlleghenyMountRadio.org. See you next time, same bad time, same bad channel.